What comes to mind when you hear the word Mercury? The planet? What about a shiny liquid metal? This Mercury is an element whose name derives from Mercurius, the fleet-footed messenger of Roman mythology. It lives in group 12, period 6 on the periodic table. It is related to zinc and cadmium. It has 80 electrons, an atomic number of 80, and an atomic weight of 200.59. You may be thinking, why is it symbol HG if neither the letter H or G is in the word Mercury? Well, it comes from the Greek word hydrargyrum, which means liquid silver. Although Mercury is a metal, it is unlike any other metal on Earth. Unlike other metals, it is a poor conductor of electricity. It is also the only metal that is a liquid at room temperature. Because of its high density at 13.5 grams per centimeter cubed, many things are able to float in it, even you. But be careful not to get too close to mercury because it is highly toxic and dangerous. In fact, mercury is not known to be dangerous until recently. Many schools would let children play with mercury and touch it. It was founded around 2000 BC and it was first seen put to use by the ancient French and Spaniards during the Stone Age who used a mercury compound as red paint. By heating the compound up, they found out that they could separate the mercury from the sulfur. They used this method to collect gold with the help of mercury. Today mercury is used for many things. Mercury can be found in batteries fluorescent lights, and thermometers and barometers. It is also present in your food. Although it is toxic, your body is able to tolerate just a little bit of it. Mercury is also frequently seen with other compounds, such as mercuric chloride, which is a very poisonous salt used to disinfect wounds, Mercurous chloride, which is an antiseptic used to kill bacteria, mercuric sulfide, which is used to make red paint pigment called vermilion, and mercuric oxide, which is used to make batteries. Although mercury is not commonly seen or even commonly known, it is one of the most interesting and best elements in the world, and although you may believe it is an insignificant factor in the world, Losing it would alter our lives.